Welcome to the Beth Fred, the Bonus King Handicap. It's at York. And welcome, obviously, to Wednesday Racing with Starter's Orders. And I hope you guys have been enjoying this week. And we bring, ours, we bring ourselves to the last um, racing day for another week of a thrilling racing on Starter's Orders. And we started off with a one mile two furlong zero to 90. Lowood Captor, that'll be your favorite. Nine or four for Doug Warren Racing. That's looking to pick up a win. Marilyn Manson, some might say. Jamie Hopkins has a massive say at five to one. And then, well, it is a very open field and you can find about 12 to one and better the rest for the rest of the field. Let's see who's going to be successful at York for the bet fret the bonus king handicap they locked they loaded they sent on their way 24 horses fighting out for a good early spot so we'll just give them some time to settle down we on the jockey cam of jr ryu who's at the back in the early stages he's settling about fourth to last he had a massive field and he is going to be struggling to make up many lengths from there so it's eight and a half now as they all try to settle down around that first bend it's going to be autumn cape graceful oryx is up there with ballymore king little girl blue jr manhattan girl then you can find mossy human race mid division in the yellow oh in the white i do apologize Apologize there, Wolf is the and then you can find Johnny the Fox, quick return, loud salvestrous further back with Bob Belcher. Then you can find J.R. Rio and feel the burn is feeling the burn at the back of the field with six and a half left to go. That's gonna be Autumn Cape leading the proceedings here by just about a narrow neck to Graceful Oryx. Ballymore King settles comfortably in third with Mossy at fourth. Then you can find Little Girl Blue and Larwood Captor starting to make up many lengths with Red Sky, Loud Salvestra, Johnny the Fox is trying to get into the race now. And as they turn in for home, a lot of horses are going to need to do a lot to get into the thick of things because Autumn Cape is not messing around now. He goes too clear again. Graceful Oryx is back in second. Quick return came from the clouds and that's suddenly into the striking position now. Larwood Captor each and every stride is trying to make a winning one. Human race further back. Human race looks to have a massive claim. That's the one in the white. A quick another. Johnny the Fox further back with Mossy. Feel the burn is starting to make progress. Big shot. Bang. And then the few back markers. It looks out of it at the two and a half. It's going to be Autumn Cape. Quick return is in second. Back in third. J.R. Manhattan girl. Human race looks a massive runner in the middle of the field. It's Autumn Cape now being tackled on the outside by Human race. Loud salvation in the Orange is now starting to make amends. It's a freeway split at this stage. Lowood Capital trying to get through, but Human Race has poked his head in front in the closing stages and looks like he's going to stay them all. And Human Race will go on a win. Back in second, Lowood Capital, Mossy Wood Bay. Boy, got back in third, very close for fourth. But I can tell you this the winner will be Human Race. Human Race wins the race here. Comfortable ride. And wins a nice one, 28 to 1, Lawwood Cap Doll, 4 to 1, joint favourite, Mossywood Boy, ran um, back in third. So the winner here will be Stu Gray, picking up a massive win here against a really big field. And Human Race, he can be proud of this one. One of the low rated horses of 52, wins well. Capdor, uh, Lawwood Cap Doll second, Mossywood Boy, did enough for third.